so what's up people uh, i think uh, everyone are doing good okay so in this video i'll teach you about uh, how do you use a uh, zcat command so zcat command is uh, basically a small command okay i can say so it is used to uh, view the content of a compressed file uh, without uh, decompressing them let's say uh, now i'll uh, do ls okay i'll go inside uh, document now if i do ls okay nano uh, file one dot txt uh, now uh, this is a uh, uh, okay this is a uh, message okay now what i do uh, if i do cat file name you can say this is a message now i use gzip then the file name and I'll compress it see you can see now the file has been compressed so I need to see the content which is inside that file which is inside that txt file what I do I use zcat then the file name so which will basically print the content which is inside the compressed file okay mm. let's say uh, you need to view the content in binary compressed file uh, which is in binary uh, let's create uh, touch dot uh, bin uh, sorry touch file dot uh, bin uh, something like that then what we do uh, nano file dot bin uh, this is uh, another message I'll save now okay now uh, what I do I use zzip and uh, uh, file dot bin and uh, you can see file dot bin is a binary file so i need to see a content from binary file so i need to use hyphen f and the file name that will be uh, binary then uh, rcat sorry uh, it is zcat not rcat ah, then you can see the content which is in the binary file okay uh, you need to force this is actually uh, forced to see the content uh, which is inside the binary file okay this is how you use it uh, you can uh, go for man page to see uh, what and all the arguments that you can use first you need to do uh, gzip not gzip okay uh, okay man page uh, just clear the screen man page z cat okay so if uh, the file is compressed or if the file is not compressed then you can use uh, zcat to what uh, display the content which is inside that uh, compressed file okay so there is many arguments that you can use if you need that file content in a ascii value then you can use hyphen e uh, if you need uh, that content in standard output you can also use hyphen c then you, if you need to decompress that file you can do d then if you need to force something to be uh, seen inside i can use okay let's uh, zcat iphone d and the file name uh, dot if i use like this uh, this will actually decompress i guess yeah maybe it will it is just uh, what uh, printing the content which is inside uh, this txt file okay so that is all guys that is up guys uh, so this is the what this is a use of uh, zcat command and uh, thank you for watching